Hello everyone, this is Elijah from Financial Anatomy, coming at you with another video to help you take control of your financial destiny. In this video, we're going to be talking about the Chime app, specifically how can you identify any reoccurring payments that you have on your statement. This can actually be pretty useful because you may be spending money on things that you probably don't need and probably would cancel if you were just aware that money was being withdrawn from your account when it comes to this stuff. So you want to first open the Chime app up. You'll then need to log in and enter your PIN number. Then you want to click the wrench icon in the top left hand corner and scroll to the very bottom. And you'll see where it says bills, view your reoccurring payments. We're going to click on that. And in my particular case, it's identified three things that I consistently spend money on on a monthly basis. That's Open Sky, which is a, a credit card payment. Squarespace, which is what I use for one of my websites. And you see Google, that's what I pay for YouTube Premium every month. If you want to see how long money has been taken out of your account on a monthly basis, just click on the bill itself. So we click on Google. You see that I've had a YouTube Premium for quite some time. Click on Squarespace, similar story. And you can even add a bill if you wanted to. So we click on add a bill. It's gonna pull up a few things that you might be spending money on on a regular basis that you might wanna add. So you can categorize it in terms of subscriptions, cable, internet, cell phone, etc. cetera. We're gonna play as if I wanted to add a Netflix subscription to Chime. Just click on Netflix. Then you'll be presented with your Chime cards and bank account and the option to actually continue towards Netflix. I'm gonna click on continue. And it's asking me to sign into Netflix. From here, you just add the information of your Chime card and you'll be ready to go. And that in a nutshell is how you can find some reoccurring expenses on your Chime account and add one if you wanted to. I think this is a useful feature because you might want to trim the fat out of your budget and see places where money is going on a regular basis that you might want to get rid of. And the fact that Chime will automatically identify this for you is a pretty useful feature. That does it for this video. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And if you have an interest in signing up for Chime but you haven't done so, you can do so using the link in the description and the pinned comment. That does it for now. I'll catch you in the next video. Don't forget to get out there and take control of your financial destiny.